to Cycle Basket. We are your favorite channel for drawing something interesting. What are we going to draw today? We're going to draw something that we all love eating so much. It's going to be a nice, juicy burger. A yummy burger with lots and lots and lots of cheese. That's what we're going to draw today. So, let's begin. What do we need? We need a sheet of paper to draw a burger on. If only our burger could come to life after drawing it, that's a separate story though. We're gonna draw it in a sheet of paper. And what we need with this with this are some colours. We are gonna be using coloured sketch pens today. You can use any colours you like. And let's begin. So we are gonna start drawing the burger with a pen. Just so that you can see clearly, you can also do this part with a pencil. Uh, to start with, we are gonna draw the burger bun. We're going to draw the top part of the bun, draw a straight line and draw a semi-circle over it. This is the burger bun. Now, this is half of the burger bun, not the whole thing. This is the top part. Now, we're going to leave some space in between and draw the bottom part of the bun, which is going to be a curvy rectangle, which is about the same size as the semi-circle you've drawn on top. Yummy, it's already taking shape, isn't it? Now this is our burger. What do we need in between? What do you usually have in your burger? Let's think. We have a patty, some lettuce, tomatoes, onions, cheese. Lots and lots of yummy cheese. So let's begin with the lettuce. On the bottom half of the patty, on the bottom half of the bun, sorry, we're going to draw a lettuce, which is just some curvy lines joined to two ends of the burger bun. This is going to be our lettuce. The next thing, after we've drawn the lettuce, the next thing we draw is the patty. Now we take our pen or our pencil and draw two straight lines upwards from the lettuce and join them in the center. This is going to be our patty. This can be any patty you like, any patty that you find really, really yummy. This is where all the flavor of the burger is. On top of this patty, we're going to keep some, let's see, cheese or tomatoes. Let's keep tomatoes first. So we're going to draw another little oval on top of the patty. This is going to be our tomato. We, what we've done here is drawn some dots on it, which are the seeds of a tomato. If you see a tomato carefully, you'll see some seeds on it. And that is what we've drawn over here. On top of this is going to be the most important ingredient. The yummiest, the cheese. Yes. One big block of cheese for this burger. Oh, that looks good. I think our burger is ready. Now, we're gonna eat our burger with something. What is it gonna be? Um, I think let's get a milkshake for our burger. Let's draw a little milkshake. It's very simple. Draw two lines, which are slightly moving towards each other and join them at the bottom with the curvy line. This is gonna be your glass. And on the top of this, draw a circle. And that's it. That's your glass of milkshake. We're going to draw a straw out of it. A bendy straw for you. For your milkshake. And your milkshake is ready. Now we're going to decorate it a bit. With some colors. Looks good. Let's start coloring this all in. Let's start with the burger buns. Mm. I think we're going to color them orange. It's going to look absolutely yummy and delicious. So color the bun in orange color. Making sure you reach right to the ends. Color it completely. Do the same thing for the other half of the bun at the bottom. So now you've colored the burger bun. The next thing you want to do is color the lettuce. Lettuce is green in color. There are different varieties of lettuce and almost almost all of them are always green. So we're going to color our lettuce green. This is what gives your burger that crunch, that yummy, yummy crunch that you like with the patty and the cheese and the sauce. next thing we're gonna color after this the next layer of the burger is the patty 
what color do we want to do with patty? Let's do brown. It's nicely fried. Sometimes this patty can also be baked if you wish. In this one, it's probably fried. Deep fried from your favorite burger joint. Color it brown. Making sure not to color inside the lettuce. Because if you notice, some of the lettuce is actually covering the patty. That's how we draw it. Now, our lettuce is done. Our patty is there. What's the next thing you stack up on the burger? It is a juicy red tomato. Now we're going to color it in red color. Red color and color it all in red. Those tomato seeds are looking quite nice in it. Now, for the last thing on the top of the stack is cheese, which we are going to color yellow. Yellow color cheese melting away on the burger. Making it so tasty. Color it all in. Yellow. Yummy. Our burger is set. Now, what we need is some sesame seeds on the top of our burger bun. So, we've colored it orange earlier, and now we're going to make some sesame seeds with our black color. Just some dots on the burger bun. All done. Let's move on. To our milkshake. What color do we want our milkshake glass to be? Mm, let's do yellow, I believe. Yellow glass would be nice. We won't color the little banner or the little sticker that we've put in between. Just the top and bottom half is going to be colored yellow. What kind of milkshake do you usually drink with your burgers? Do you like a vanilla or a strawberry or a chocolate, blueberry? I personally like a strawberry milkshake and okay now we've colored the glass now we need to color the sticker what color do we want to do the sticker at the top of the glass let's do something different let's do purple for the sticker and we'll color it all in I think we can make the straw green. It would look nice. It matches with the color, bright green color of the lettuce. So this is going to be a milkshake. Yummy! That's it. I think we've drawn a burger and milkshake, and that is the drawing for you. Make sure you draw this and let us know how you do. Share pictures with us and. If you like it, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much. Until next time, bye.